All right, yeah, hello, welcome to my new video. Oh yeah, today you see no drum kit here because today is an awesome day. I got a new drum kit, oh yeah. I got a Pearl Expert, of course, Pearl drum kit in the beautiful color electric blue sparkle. And this is an unboxing video for you today of this kit because I thought it would be really great to do this. And this is the first time I do a kind of a video like this. No drum cover, something other, something else with the drums, yeah. That's why we do this here today. This is part one of the unboxing because I didn't get anything till now. Didn't get anything, I don't have anything right now. That's because the new Evans hats are, aren't there now. They need to come there, so I'm waiting, and one floor time is missing, so if you know my style when playing, I'll play with two floor drums, and on this full package kit was the 16 of floor drum, and I ordered a single shell 14 inch floor drum, so yeah, that's, that isn't there, but we can start, of course, without them. For uh, the other parts that still need to come, I'll go through a part two, yeah? Yeah. So, and that tell me a little bit the story before we put anything up. But I actually wanted to buy only the single shell. That means only the rack toms, the floor toms, and the bass drum, and one tom stand. No other hardware. Because I actually didn't need all the other hardware. and. The symbols who are there to the video. That means, but the the bad thing was that the single bass drum was only available in August. Yeah, that I didn't want to wait so long. That's why I bought a full package kit with hardware, a single pedal for bass drum, a snare stand, hi hat stand, the tom arms, symbol stands. There. And the symbols there. Well, what we have there, I'll show you later. So that's why we have that one. Now. But we are happy about this to have it, of course. So then that starts the unboxing right now. I, as you can see, I already cut this box open, and because I really couldn't wait, and I wanted to see if anything, everything is there. Yeah, but uh, I didn't pull anything out right now, so didn't see the whole glory right now. We start with the tiny one. This is the 10 inch tom, the 10 inch add on tom. And all we've got here the hardware, the, the clam. Yeah. We can. Wait. Ah. <laughs> Where you can tighten down the drum. Beautiful double inch clown with the Pearl logo on up. You can see it, you're not too far away here. This is really great, so we put it down right here. Yeah. <clears throat> then we've got first the Tom arm, the Tom mount. Oh, come out. <laughs> it's always like Christmas, you know? It's really, really great. And this is. Yeah, the thumb arm. It looks beautiful too. Oh, right. So amazing, yeah. Really amazing. And of course, oh, okay. <laughs> just right. The thumb, yeah. Oh, this looks so amazing. I'm gonna put this up. Right here. Uh, so much stuff that comes out here. <laughs> this is the beautiful Pearl Expert 10 inch tom in electric blue sparkle. And goddamn, <laughs> this looks amazing. All right. Ooh. And the beautiful tom mount here where you can put uh, the tom arm through. God, this is. Oh, holy shit, all right, yeah. Woo -hoo -hoo. We put it, I don't think it's down there. 
Oh, this is amazing. Oh, this looks so good. Oh, yeah. So, first box is done. Then we start with this. Uh, when we, we don't start, we already started. We do it on with this box here. So here we have another jam. This is the 12 inch jam, I believe, yeah. So beautiful too, so amazing, yeah. Mwah. God, I love this finish, this look. I'm really blessed. Don't know what to say because this is so amazing. Probably you make so amazing stuff already. Got to. So I'm really excited playing. Yeah. So. Here. Let's. Uh, no, the leaf. Now this is. No, this is the snare. We do the 30 inch tongue first. in an extra box. Okay. Uh, the other thing did. <laughs> Beautiful too. What what should I say? Yeah. Got them. Always feeling like back of the house. Open it. Oh, this isn't good. What did you do? So fortunately, I don't play the original hat because it's destroyed right now. Something laid on it. Maybe the snow grass or snow. It actually, what what? It works in an expert box, so you can see if the batter hat is destroyed. Of course, I don't use it. Fortunately, ooh, that's not so good. Okay, but yeah, like I said, fortunately, we won't play it. This really good. Oh, so, oh, yeah. got some more here. Oh, let's open these first. What do we have here? Really don't know. I'm excited. Oh, yeah. We think we need this knife. I'll get it. Get it open. Ah, oh, come on. Drum key, always good to have it. And the bass drum claws for for the bass drum, of course. Yeah. Here, here we have all the claws. I'll put them back, back in so that we don't lose anyone. And then we put this to the side. <laughs> a little bit funny. So let's see what we get into here. are the rectum arms. So much dark and stuff in there, right? <laughs> Of 
purse, steal a scroll, a stainless scroll. Amazing. Really, really good. Uh, for the rectums, I forgot to tell you it is good that we are back on 10 inch, 12 inch, and 13, 13 inch because um, the green export kit, you know, out of, out from all of my videos, I played 8, 10, and 12, so the, the smaller ones, and it wasn't always so easy to get into the hat. I always, uh, really often hit the rims, and of course. If you know the stick that I use, the Vic Fur 2B sticks, really big sticks, and if you, have, you really know that I use the thick side of my sticks, so I don't play the tip, I play the thick side, and yeah, that's even even more harder to um, get those uh, to hit the hat with uh, on the tiny toms, yeah. That's why it's great to be back on. 10, 12, and 30 minutes. And here we've got the Broughton legs for the 16 inch Broughton. Yeah, you know what these are. I left them in. And, and last but not least, oh yeah, the snare. All right. And this beautiful finish too, right? Oh hell yeah. Yeah, this is the snare to the kit. In this beautiful finish too, but I won't play these snares because this is the wood snare and I'll prefer prefer steel snares. I prefer this snare. That's why I play my beautiful sensitone for black snare tuba kit. So to have a good sound because this snare has an awesome crack above this. Of course of the, the steel, yeah. There's no wood of course to make those cracky plank sounds. It's cracking. I really love this in the sound. And to have some some contrast on the look, of course all Terms are blue sparkle, they are electric blue sparkle, and then we have this great black snare to look at. Here, this is really great. I really like those kind of things. <laughs> and then, and the, this snare I will use for live gigs from a backup snare. Yeah, if you have someone, if anything get destroyed or something happens with the main snare, then it's good to have. A backup snare, right? So, and then the last shelf and the biggest one. Right? So, of course, with the bass drum. Here we've got the cold bass drum hat. That we won't play, of course. Oh, this is destroyed as well. Not good, Pearl. So, what should we use right now? We actually, I, I, I maybe can glue it here, but. Not really good. I really can be happy that I play my Evans Heavyweight Bass Drum Hats on it. Well, this is. Not so good. So it can be Paul, uh, but also can be Backshot who packed it for me. But if you have some holes or something into your hat, it's not really funny, right? But here we've got with no holes. Oh yeah, yeah. Because the other hat laid on it, so we got no. Well, we've got a little, I hope it doesn't get through. 
We've got the front hatch, and I'm really not sure right now if I'm playing this on the front or if I put my death hat based on hatch on the front. All right. I'm not, I'm not so sure about it yet. So we put them over here. So much stuff over here. Got really tight in here, so paper. And then we've got into the base drum the 16 inch float drum. Very beautiful one too. Of course in the same finish, yes. Are so amazing. Got them hell yeah. Woo woo woo. Mwah. <laughs> yeah. Right. So right. Isn't this great? Isn't that great? Are got them so awesome. So we would put. <laughs> where do we put it? We put it over there. Oh yeah. <laughs> And then, of course, last but not least, the bass drum. <laughs> so this is good that the wood tube comes with some, some protect and stuff on it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, Are so good. Baby. This looks really amazing too. Too much stuff. Oh. <laughs> I'm so happy right now. Baby, this is God so amazing. Oh, we've got, got a pillow in, into it. That's cool. Maybe we use this for, for dampening. That's pretty cool. I'll, I will take this later up. Some smacking. So, so yeah. Lots of beautiful face firm here, too. Got so amazing. That I have to walk through it to uh, put it over there. Yes. This face firm is a. 22 by 18 inch from again on the green expert kit I had I played a 22 by 20 inch bass drum and I really like that the extra inch to have some more boom yeah some extra bass boom but now we are back with 22 by 18 inch, 18 inch because in the expert series you have no, no 22 by 20 inch bass drum again. I was a little bit sad about it, but maybe, or I know not maybe, I think it's gonna be really funny and amazing too with this bass drum as well. Yeah. And then we've got some cool pillow, deafening pillow for the bass drum to get damp, damp the bass drum sound. I think we will really use this. Really cool. I didn't expect that it's into it there. And of course the second hoop. And now we are opening the last box, the hardware package. Oh, it's the heavy.
have used. <laughs> of course, we have so much metal, metal interiors. Yeah. So, this is the, the foot pedal, the single pedal. Let's get this open. Demonator single pedal. I have the Demonator double pedal on my Deathhead drum kit and not at them. And I won't play the single pedal, of course. I have my Illuminator power shifter double pedal that I will play on. Yeah, but I think there is a drum key too into it because always when you're playing the pedal yeah there is another drum key so now we have two and the beater of course and some cool hoop protecting for the bass drum hoop that we will use on our double pedal to or not rub off the wood and to get the, the bass drum pedal really tight yeah so that's really useful too yeah all right, let's put it back in to not last to get a lot some more place. All right. Arr. This is so full. So what do we get into here? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. snare stand that I would use of course it looks really like some good hardware it's pearl of course it's good hardware and I will use this for my snare yeah This is the Hyatt machine, our new Hyatt machine that I will use too. So I'm not so worried about that I get a hot package package anymore. Yeah, the Hyatt stamp. And this is with the Demonator pedal style, foot pedal too, huh? Pretty awesome as well. And two more, those are the cymbal stands. Guard so much <laughs> Oh yeah. Yes, they are. God damn. For a good time. And is this the good clutch or is it? It looks like a good sumo clutch. Yeah. With some good spells. We will play our, our blue simpax on it because to the blue kit, we have to play the blue simplex, of course. And that's the, the straight symbol stand. Yeah, yeah, it is.
And there's the second one. And this is another straight symbol stand. I first they were actually the boom symbol stand. So it's not a bad idea to get them together right now to have not so much stuff to fly around. So flying around in here. Let's do this with the other one too. Where is it? But there is no straight symbol stand. I thought that would come a boom symbol stand and a straight symbol stand like you normally have it. But I'm um, not worried about or set because if you don't use a rack system on your drum kit, you actually don't need a boom symbol stand. You, if you have it just on stamp and everything, you can always do it with straight symbol stand, yeah? So, now is everything put it out. I'm really happy to see all this great stuff. I'm not so happy to see that two or three of the heads are destroyed with holes from whatever it was, from the package center or something into the boxes, from the driving, from Dexter who drives this kit to me there. Yeah or from back shop something. That I'm not I'm not so happy about this there. Yeah. But like I said we don't play the original hats. We put our Evans hat on of course. Yeah this is part one. Part two will follow soon if I get uh, when when I get my new Evans hats, the G2 coated for the toms and the heavyweight for the snare new one. And the 14 inch floor toms there, yeah, tar. That's what I really need too. But I really couldn't wait to put the stuff out and to fill it up right now. I really need to play this, no matter with which hats. I really need to play this. But I won't show you how I set the whole thing up because it really takes a long time for me. It will take at least two and a half hours. And I know I could make it later faster on the video editor, but then it would take still one hour so i'll bring you back in now we see it in the second part and then i'll bring you back in uh, for the second part of the unboxing and then i'll bring you back in to see the whole glory when everything is set it well up really tuned well really in tone and then we do the sound test of course and a first impression of the playing be excited for this for the part two and for the sound and everything and it's gonna be amazing. Oh hell yeah! Oh hell yeah! Ha! Now we are on the part two of the unboxing because finally my 14 inch floor term for the export drum kit arrived. So, and yeah, here you, behind me you can see the um, rest of the kit already set it up and really played in because we are one week after the selling right now with the second part so because uh, the kit came on wednesday last week and now we are on thursday so one week and one day after it we got finally almost everything not <laughs> i will tell you later why but, uh, so it's really awesome i played it with the 40 inch bottom of my Green Expert Kit, which I played before. This is a really good student pupil kit for drum, for my drum students. Really great. So let's start this unboxing here right now. Oh yeah. And uh, forget everything what I thought, what what I said about the straight uh, the the blue symbol stand. It is a blue symbol stand. I didn't see it because it was packed like a straight symbol stand and. I said you actually only need it when you uh, use it for rack system, but now you can see how you can see it from there. It's <laughs> yeah, I use it like a, for my 20 
from scratch, from those from the aspirate, and it worked really great. So now let's unbox our 40-inch floor from the last piece of this beautiful kit. So I cut it, this box open too before because I wanted to see what we have here. First of all, again, the floor tone wax, really important because it's a standard floor tone again, really great. This floor tone from the Green Expo kit was the hanging floor tone. It was great, but to adjust the height and the wind, so the, the, the angle, sorry, for that German word. <laughs> and it's better to have a standard floor tone. So that's why. Here we have the legs. Ah. Really good chrome and the, the feet are here. Ah, okay, from this side, it's better. Really great. Oh, hell yeah. And of course, the brown. So. Oh, yeah. Yeah, of course, the pearl breakfast again. And we have that pearl expert sign. Really great, right too. Now we have a lot of them. And here is my glory charm. With the same stupid pill has balance of this for you. Oh yeah. Oh, from this side better. In that same part here, in that same glory finish, the electric spark blue is still amazing. Yeah, finally we have the 14 by 14 inch floor tone. So that I can the 14, that I can play the 14 and the 16 inch. This is really awesome. And of course, what is missing? Good hats, yeah. And of course, here we have my favorite drum hats of our time, my favorite drum company, Evans Drum Hats. For the snare drum, my favorite snare drum hat of all time. Of course, it never breaks. I never got it broken. I think I ne will never do it too. The Evans Heavyweight, so awesome. And for the Toms, my favorite Tom hats with you two coated. You know, I used the easy two hats. Uh, yeah, um, lastly, on the Green Expert kit, I tried them out, but. I found out that I need to go back to the YouTube coded. And now the problem, we can't put on the hats right now because this is the seventh piece set up and the music store where I ordered the floor tom and the hats didn't send me the 12 and the 14 inch hats. So that's why I have to use so I asked, asked them, I told it to them, they sent it back, but we don't have it right now. So that's why we still need to use the old hats. So, yeah. But it's okay, so it's a bit bad to have a new hat and to you can't put them on right now because it's a little bit stupid to put them on right now and then put the two hats you are missing on later here. Yeah. That's why we do it when the full hat setup is there. Then I'll give you another video. I wanted to finish it that right now. That's why we do it with the old hats. And yeah, so now put the 40 inch floor tone together, put it to the set, and then we see us back for a great sound. Oh no, not now. Of course, uh, so the last thing I want to show you, I bought a new headphones for drumming, the Fame headphones from Music Store, Music Store home brand. They are pretty good. It's actually the same model that Toman has from T-Bone. It's the real same for the same price. They make 
the same headphones. The only thing that is different is the name on it. Then it's the totally real headphone. And the, the cable on the Toman headphones on the T-Bone are a little bit longer, but it was too long always. So I ordered it on the music store, that's why I brought the Fame headphones for drumming. It's the real same. And yeah, a huge dance drummer, drummer headphone. That's why it's pretty great. So yeah, now we put the 40 inch floor term to the kit. Then we see us back for a whole kit to again to show you all the detailed stuff again. And a sound test, of course. It's gonna be amazing. Oh yeah. Well, yeah, now actually everything is set it well up, uh, stands really great, has a uh, right angle, everything stands how I need it, so almost everything. I'm not so sure how if I let this 14 inch floor tom here or so. I have to try to play it in this angle because. When I do it in another angle, or it's too short. Yeah, or, or it's a little bit. Uh, maybe this this better. So yeah, um, like I said, we have now the the old hats on on this damage tone. We have the almost <laughs> destroy it easy two. Then on this terms because the other easy cues you can't play them anymore. <laughs> we have two old D2s out of my used hat collection, Evans hat collection, only Evans hat, of course. And on this floor terms, we have those easy two two, easy twos two, yeah. On the bass drum, we have, of course, our Evans heavyweight and clear again, with a new clear double pedal patch which makes gives a small attack and which makes it really more yeah it sounds great again to not destroy the actually hat so it's always better when you 
have to buy only the patch then all the time another baseline hat. And of course the old heavyweight on the snare encoded lathes. And yeah, the snare is the only drum that I that is not out of the expert series like I said before. It is the Sandy tone in black from Pearl, of course. And it's so amazing to have the whole kit together. This amazing Pearl Expert in electric blue sparkle as the six piece kit with the snare. It's the seven piece, but we don't use the snare. We will use the snare drum in a separate video for our sound test. So I'm not so sure. I need to test it when I can put another heavyweight. I need to uh, air, yeah, so to hear because of course I won't play those pearl heads and of course I hope to get soon some other weather heads as well because they sound so terrible from pearl. You can't use them, really not. Only the drums and the hardware is good. This is bash. There are no better, but. The heads are really bad, and the cymbals, if you know that Pearl makes cymbals too, are made. I don't know if they do, if they still do it. But they are really terrible too, and their heads are maybe those proton heads that they use for higher um, series than the expert series. Maybe they are better, but those uh, Pearl heads made by Remo are really, really bad. So. Not really good, don't play them. <laughs> That's why we have those old Evans hats on it, because we can't play it with the hats who where where the kids come where the kid is coming with are not really good. So yeah, now we do a sound test. Of course it won't sound as good as it would with nice Evans Razor hats and new Tom hats and snare hats. Oh the snare is actually pretty good in tune. But the toms are here. Yeah, I try to tune it a bit now, and then we see it's back right now for a sound test. It'd be, it's gonna be amazing. I hope so. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs>
So yeah, that's actually it for the whole video, for the unboxing and the setting up where I didn't show it. But for the sound test, for everything, for setting up, yeah, it's amazing. I love this kit right now, as you could see in the sound test video where I played the solo solo, the solo solo. I still have problems to get those new positions because uh, I had uh, to position some of those times new series. Yeah, I still have to learn to get into it, but it's good. It's actually set it up how it should stand. And yeah, it'll be great. I love it. I'll give you another sound update when I have the full new hats, and maybe then I have the Evans Rizzo hats too. For, for the chumps under the snare, we already have it, but not for the chumps, and maybe then we have some much better tones than we have it right now. Now it sounds pretty good already, but it can be so much greater. Of course, with those great hats, Evans are the best, you know, Phil are the best, so it's not like fair. Regret, yeah, this was amazing. I hope this weren't too long for you, this video. And I hope you really enjoyed it to set uh, to unbox this great Arsen kit with me and to see it there. So great, yeah. And that's actually it. Yeah, actually. All right. Well, one thing I wanted to tell you about is the bass drum. I I changed the depth like may maybe uh, I can, maybe I'll show it to you again. Uh, in the unboxing video I showed you the pillow, the base from pillow, but we don't use this anymore. In my other base from I hope you can see it here. I put it ah, maybe come on this. I put it this naps that are back in to uh, this is uh, greater dampening for me I like it pretty much more it's so amazing the bass from sounds much better with it the pillow is to last damping that really doesn't damp so great so it's much better with this oh yeah cursed uh, yeah you have this well, boom, right? And of course, with the micro, yeah, but I really love this sound, yeah. That's where it's really neat. But I for great questions. So, yeah. If you liked this video, please subscribe to my channel, like and share my videos, leave a comment to my videos, and I hope that you really had some great much fun with that. Oh, yeah. Oh, hey, before you leave, I forgot one thing to say. Of course, this is my new video kit here in the room where I rehearsal as much. Yeah. That's why I have, and I, you know, I record my videos here. That's why this is my new video kit. And so that if you don't want it too much, you will see the green export kit in a few more videos because pre-production is everything, so yeah, I actually always, almost always uh, um, record videos on Monday, so and then I do five or six videos on one day, and that's why they are still there, and I really don't want to record them new, that's why there will be three videos and the wrap of, of 
half of the house of good and bones front cover range part two will be with this kit of course but then after it next week you will see this glory kit in all of our videos yeah it's gonna be so amazing now we are out goodbye see you in the next video oh yeah